Sagittarius, hello wise people, this is your reading in June, I'm recording this mid-June 2024, it's not for something specific um, that I started with, I just asked what is important for you to know, so we'll see whatever comes out, I've asked what is the situation that needs highlighting, what is the challenge and what is the guidance? And stay until the end because I've pulled some more cards for um, guidance right at the end um, for you. And um, let's see what we got. So the highlighted situation, we got the Eight of Wands. Um, yeah, the Eight of Wands, clarified by the Page of Cups, the Six of Pentacles, the Queen of Cups, and the two of wands so some of you may be dealing with a water sign pisces cancer scorpio at least one um and it seems it's about forward movement it's about fast movement and it's about communication as well so some of you um may have to communicate or have communicated already and it's as I said perhaps with a water sign person or about a water sign person but also it can be about emotions and it can be about a child too for some of you so everyone has a different stories on a different timeline take what resonates with you I'm trying to give you as many put possibilities um, as possible so everyone gets a message and some guidance here so some of you may have to make sure you speak in a certain way a loving way or some of you may actually sweet talk somebody actually um, because they are waiting to make a decision and perhaps you want them to make a decision that suits you um, obviously not for all that's for some um, or some of you may be dealing with somebody who's emotional themselves some of you may be emotional yourselves um, so that is the highlighted situation the challenge seems to be and here you came up with your own um, card with the temperance so we got the temperance the uh, the empress again your card the knight of wands the moon and the strength a lot of major arcana in the challenge so seems to be affecting you on a bigger scale or in a more impor important purposeful way it's about finding balance and it's about um, transmuting it's about transmuting energy um, and and finding peace as well for some of you um, could be so some may be dealing with another Sagittarius some may be dealing with an earth sign Taurus Virgo Capricorn or another fire sign like yourself um, oh I said that Sagittarius sorry it doesn't have to be just Sagittarius it can be also Aries or Leo we got Leo card twice Sagittarius twice um and as I said, we go water. Actually, I just realized now we have every element. Okay, okay. So that shouldn't be, you know, necessarily that relevant. Um, so it's about finding balance. It's about finding uh, peace. And it can be to do with a family situation. But for some of you, it can also be with a... Um, love situation but more than love i'm seeing passion and um attraction and sex so it's about perhaps um finding a way to process 
something that initially seemed just or was intended to be just to do with passion and attraction um however going back to the other more people who are dealing with a family situation it can be about parenting but it could also be with other members of the family who are abroad or traveling abroad um, or it could be moving through some hidden stuff that affect emotionally whether it's you or somebody else and affect the ego some people might have been going away or want to be going away because they are struggling with their their emotions and their ego and the advice here in the advice position we got the knight of pentacles the seven of wands the ten of pentacles the knight of swords and the hermit so some of you may be dealing with a virgo some of you may be dealing with other uh, earth signs as i mentioned um some of you may just be finding things are moving too slow and some of you may be defending your legacy whether it's family or work and there may be some arguments about that and you may find yourself on your own or feel like you're on your own and having to, you know, go through this battle on your own. Um, however, you are, even if slow, you're pushing through. Even if you feel defensive at times, you're still moving forward. Um, if you have to defend a legacy, you're going to do it, you're going to argue your point, you're going to look at things from a different angle, you're going to uncover the truth as well. And as I said um, at the end, I will ask for some more guidance for you in case something was not... Um, revealed or not enough and we have the wheel of fortune the two of cups the seven of pentacles and the six of cups interestingly enough we have the wheel of fortune here as well on the main deck if you see so that is double um, energy so very much confirmation and we have here the the eight of wands again on the clarifying deck so very very interesting very strong energy which i will say the way i i see this um things are changing in your life and they are fated changes with the wheel of fortune and with the wheel of fortune twice and you're moving forward and with this eight of wands twice there is you know communication fast communication as well um so your life is about to change whether you're aware or not i believe a lot of you are aware because you are um quite in tune with the universe and your spirituality and it's going to change in terms of relationships specifically for some of you in terms of love life and a um, romantic relationship so something fated is happening whether you're coming out of a relationship it was meant to happen whether you're moving into a relationship it will be meant to happen um, with this a uh, seven of pentacles you're waiting for things to you or you will if you aren't already to unravel when a, a reunion is going to happen so you're either coming out of a relationship and going to be reunited with somebody else from your past as you actually in a way expect to happen or you are going to meet someone that you will realize is meant for you it's very much like um fated 
uh, no, like a destined type of relationship. Somebody that you have a connection with from the past um, and you feel is going to support you better, to love you better, to know you better, to understand you better. So I hope this helped Sagittarius and um, if you don't mind, subscribe, like, share, hit the notification bell as I don't have yet a schedule as I'm busy and um, if you do that, it, you'll get notified when I upload again. Um, obviously, if you comment, let me know that helps. Um, if you comment, helps the channel and I'll be grateful for that. If you comment, I will read, I will reply and let me know where you are on your journey and how this resonated, please. And until next time, be loved and be happy.